Our 26th president of the United States, Teddy Roosevelt, he once stated, speak softly and carry a big stick. Speak softly is diplomacy, but diplomacy will only work if you have the strength to back it up. Ladies and gentlemen, behind me, to the right, to the left, is the big stick. The ones who do the work, who put in the sacrifice every day to make sure that this country, this most beautiful, great nation, still stands. During my time here in the MEF, gosh, I could, I could go on and on. So much has happened over the last little over three years. And, and first off, we have 53,000 Marines and Satyrs who every day are just training to prepare to do what some, someday our nation may ask them to do and need them to do. Here in one MEF, we have the, we have the aviation combat element who's, who drops bombs from the skies and provides a close air support and direct support and provides lift and capabilities. We have the ground combat element from our infantrymen who cross the objective to our tanks and artillery to provide fire support and our logistics Marines who keep it and sustain us for the long fight. And every day, all of those elements of the MAGTAF are, are training and preparing and deploying. And right now, as we speak, many of them are in harm's way. It's just an incredible place to be full of incredible Marines and sailors. I think it's critical to, to conduct a great turnover because as Marines, we always want to leave whatever we receive in better condition than, than we received it. We want to turn it over in better condition. Everything from our gear to our weapons to our facilities and most importantly, our people. As the Sergeant Major, I owe it to those Marines to do a great turnover because the people in this organization are what's important and a better turnover that I can do and, and set my uh, replacement Sergeant Major Porterfield up for success. It helps those Marines and sailors who is the backbone of what we do every day here in One Meth. I'm both honored and humbled to um, to continue to lead the legacy of One Meth. Throughout our history, One Meth has been the war fighting um, organization that our country and our nation has leaned on, and uh, that's important. So I'm just honored and humbled to uh, to be in replacing them. Um, one of my mentors at Sergeant Major Castle. Throughout my career, I've pretty, been pretty diverse in, in opportunities and different billets, and, uh, and for that, I mean, it's kind of really helped shape me who I am today, along with um, some exceptional um, mentors and guidance that I've received throughout my career. So I think all those um, together over 29 years has kind of been my secret of success. One of my um, main priorities is for uh, all Marines and sailors to, to really live up to our, um, continue to live up to our core values of honor, courage, and commitment. But more importantly, to take care of each other, um, both on and off duty, and not have a bystander mentality because we need to make sure that we pr truly protect what we've earned.